Dr. Anand uh, secured a, a common meritless rank of uh, seven in the recently concluded NESS uh, neurosurgery exam. And uh, that by all means is a very, very, very uh, deserving uh, success for the amount of effort that he had put in to uh, come true. All right. So with this brief introduction, I would like to know about your preparation strategy for the recently concluded NESS exam. So, Actually, after passing uh, MS uh, in 2020, uh, uh, I was uh, ser serving a three years compulsory bond. So during that period, I started preparing for neurosurgery. All right. So, uh, uh, what were what all what all were your preparation? What all were the uh, weapons in your preparation arsenal? Like uh, what books you read? What what, or what notes? You followed something like you. Can you elaborate on that, or did you have to read Greenberg? So, that that kind of stuff. So uh, I I must say, uh, your notes. Uh, uh, actually, the the videos in which uh, you were teaching neurosurgery, uh, that was the only thing. Uh, uh, after seeing those videos, I made my handwritten notes, and uh, I revised again and again those notes only. And I must say, uh, I did not go through Greenberg or humans or any other textbook. Okay. So this is the first time someone openly tells me that they have not read Greenberg. Because uh, the because people, uh, trust me, because uh, people think that Greenberg is essential for uh, cracking uh, neurosurgery exam, but that's not true. It's enough if you, you have to have a good understanding of neuroanatomy, neurosurgery, neurology concepts to crack through the exam. So, so I'm glad that uh, the videos helped you a lot in uh, understanding uh, the neuroanatomy and uh, neurosurgery part. How long did it take for you to watch the videos and uh, revise, take notes and revise those stuff? So the, on an average, uh, it was uh, uh, two to three times the duration of videos. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Two to three times the duration you had to watch. So the videos were around, I believe, around 40 hours. So you had to watch it like three times. So three times yeah. to... And you made notes every time you watch the videos added yeah, on points. Sure. Okay. And how about MCQs? How about MCQs? Uh, what did you do for MCQs? I, I, I solved very less of them, I must say. Okay. Uh, so right. actually, so, those those hand, those handwritten notes were the only thing that I went through uh, each and every went, time. Okay. So how about the test series? Did you join the test series, MCQs for the test series and something like that? Uh, sir, Dr. Reels, just read. Uh, you attend the Dr. Reels. Uh, okay. Yeah. So, so, okay. So, now that uh, you, you, this is your, this preparation strategy uh, was for uh, watching videos and making notes out of those videos and revising them. Yes. So, what, what was in your yes. mind for the last 10 days? How did you approach the last 10 days? Because it's a very crucial period, like, because you will already be under stress. And uh, so, in that, in that case, how did you manage to cope up with that? So uh, actually, uh, in the NEET exam, uh, which I gave uh, on 2nd September, I did not perform well in that exam. And uh, when the result came, uh, my rank was uh, something around 1200. Okay. So obviously, I felt depressed. Uh, but uh, my friends, my wife, everyone pushed me to, uh, to go on studying uh, and prepare for INISS. Very well. And uh, that helped me a lot. So okay. in, in that, uh, uh, near, near about 1.5 months period, uh, I went through neurosurgery. I divided it to one to one to two times. Okay. Okay. So the notes uh, you revised it again. Again during the last 10 yes, three days, you had to revise all your notes again. So basically, your notes yeah. uh, yes, was everything for you. That's very yes, nice. Obviously. So uh, so now that the results are done and tested, uh, I hope you feel. A uh, bit relieved and relax and get to spend more time with the family. Obviously. All right. Yes. Sir. Okay. So, if there is an advice that you would like to give to the juniors on how to start preparation or how to approach it, what would be your uh, thoughts on it? So, the, actually, uh, nowadays uh, when people are preparing for NEET SS, you know, obviously preparing for a super specialty subject uh, is a difficult task, but. Uh, you can do it uh, if you're passionate enough for uh, pursuing, uh, I mean, uh, for neurosurgery candidates, I'm saying. Yeah. And uh, uh, online videos are of great help. Okay. And, uh, okay. So that, that would be your uh, advice to them. 
to uh, so basically one even uh, the, this is a very good example because one exam result goes against you and uh, the minute it goes against you you get to you tend to lose your uh, hope uh, tend no more than hope you tend to lose your heart about it like you you would have prepared so much for that and uh, the one exam which has more number of seats when uh, you don't uh, 1200 is not it's not very far it's a, it's a decent rank but thing is you would have aimed for somewhere higher you would have aimed for somewhere higher and when you were not able to reach that target you would have felt a little bit disappointed but thing is you did not lose heart and you uh, you trusted your hard work you had trust on your hard work and uh, of course the family support is very important uh, especially during those stressful moments of the last few days before the exam that is very important and uh, and i'm very happy that uh, this has come out very nicely for you because now you can go out to choose uh, whichever place you want you you can choose among the best so that is what has happened now that is uh, that is entirely down to your uh, uh, sir, hard work sir, all sir all 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 credit goes to you sir all credit goes to you it's your hard work <laughs> it's your hard work man only guiding you up i was only guiding you where how to approach it that's it so uh, very happy for your uh, success sir i sir uh, i would sir i would like to tell you that uh, i am a slow reader so uh, going through greenberg was not possible for me so revising the notes again and again helped me very much yes that's a that very smart strategy you know like uh, uh, when you write something and you revise it that actually sure. gets imprinted in your brain that actually gets imprinted in your brain and the chance of you making a mistake out of it is very less because basically in the videos we have discussed almost the entire neurosurgery part this a comprehensive description of more of, of almost everything so that certainly would have helped you and of course you had to make the notes revise it again so the entire hard work lies in you so this is a very smart strategy that you trust what you have in your hand and you go about it so this is a very good example of despite being in desperate times like uh, getting behind in one them and uh, running against time but still managing to hit the target that's very that's very remarkable and i'm very happy for you to have achieved this target so all the best all the very best for the uh, residency and stay calm and you will have a good future god bless thank you thank you sir